So today we have an interesting case on our hands. We have been getting reports of people defecating on lawns. Did you say defecating? You heard this right. This isn't a joke. You got it, Chief. We'll get it done. These two are the best detectives I have on this force. Get to the bottom of this. This just doesn't smell right. Doing this on the report. Go and see what you can find out. Jeez, what a party pooper. All right, let's go out and talk to these victims. Excuse me, Professor. Can we ask you a few questions? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's going on? Uh, what can you tell us about the talk to you guys all day about it? Uh, this morning, I came out to get my newspaper. Um, as I was walking out, there was a man running out of my yard, pulling his pants up. Crazy. Um, I try to chase him, assuming he's doing something wrong. Chase after him. He's too fast for me. I'm a pretty big guy, so I couldn't catch him. Uh, so I turned back around, walked back to my lawn, and that's when I saw it. This giant, massive log just sitting in the middle of the grass. Can you describe this man in any way? Did he say anything when you chased him down? Yeah, he was about, I would say, five foot eight to six foot. Uh, did you see any physical th traits like ethnicity? Yeah, he was as brown as a log in the yard. Any idea of who this could have been? You think it might have been a little kid playing a prank or done with malicious intent? Well, if I'm being honest, this isn't the first time it's happened. This just was the only. F this was the first time that I actually had an altercation with the individual. It's kind of a pattern. It happens a specific day of the week, every week. Do you have any reason to suspect anyone? They could be anybody, like a neighbor or an old friend or acquaintance. Mm, not that I can think of. I don't have any bad blood with anyone. The only thing I can really tell you guys is that I know my neighbor's son was out jogging that morning. Do you have any reason to suspect anyone? They could be anybody, like a neighbor or an old friend or acquaintance. Mm, not that I can think of. I don't have any bad blood with anyone. The only thing I can really tell you guys is that I know my neighbor's son was out jogging that morning. about an incident involving a deuce on the lawn and uh, it, we were talking to the neighbor about the deuce on the lawn yeah and uh, it, we also talked to your father and your father said that you were running around that time yeah i like to run you know i like to get myself you been on your dog like anything out of the ordinary yeah when i was finishing my run i seen my neighbor chasing down somebody Can you describe the suspect in that fight yeah he was 5'7 180 he looked mexican Thank you for the information, it's going to turn out to be useful. You're so why do you think this person is dumping on lawns? <clears throat> I don't know, you have to imagine he has a pretty good reason for doing it. At least that's what we hope for. Otherwise, his life is probably going down the dump. Yeah, our only real suspect is this neighbor's kid, and he happens to fit the description of the criminal, as well as his alibi conflicting with the time of the incident. Well, since they probably know that the police are involved in this pattern, He's more likely to go in the shift what he's trying to say. Oh shit. Hey, is. you stop! Yo, he just got in his car. He's taking off. Alright. Hey, you get out of the car! Freeze! Bang, bang, bang. Scrap, scrap, scrap. Bend down, bend down. <laughs> hey, man. You're all right. Ugh.